Oh shit. Cat knows what's up. What? Where's my camera? Oh wow. Haha! <laughs> Cat! Thank you, Cat. You're very helpful. Uh oh. Needs to be a little higher. Exactly, cat. You know what's up. Well, hello, chat. How are you? I'm getting set up here, so you'll have to bear with me for a few minutes. But I needed to make sure I made it in under that wire. Uh, Thirty minutes, because otherwise the stream would have been free. Now, because I've started later, it'll be more expensive. You guys can pay me the million dollars or whatever. I don't understand why you get so noisy when I stream. Are you jealous? I'm not even going to dignify that with a response. Huh? <laughs> I love my cat. She's so weird. Alright, let me actually like bring up the chat and stuff. I should probably also, hang on a second here, bring my video manager and Twitter. Yeah, I'm just going to use my computer. Because I am pretty sure that I exported those first two to YouTubes. But I don't think I exported last week, so I'm going to check here. Beep. I, I played a test message. It's me. I played a test message. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, okay, those two are both there. <laughs> Are you guys seeing this? My cat is ridiculous. Cat, I'm trying to do work. I see Tomothy, I see Laserbeak's Fury. I gotta refresh my page though, I think my Twitch chat is fucking up. No, not right now, Cat. You have to sit over there. So yeah, for those of you just filing in, it's just gonna be a couple minutes while I do a few things and then we'll get started. But uh, I just wanted to make sure I went live so you all saw that I was here and on time. Stuff. All right. Weed. 
<laughs> now it is cat chat. It is totally cat chat. Just have to do one more thing and then we are go. I feel very far away though. My camera's like. It has decided that it needs me to be really tiny. Please calm down, cat. I know you're very excited, but you're you're a little too excited, I have to say. You're so excited. Alright. Okay, chat. Who wants to dirtle some dragons? Cat, let's put you over there. Oh, hey, Zanaid. Room of Coin is here. Hooray. And Jaconius, who says it has been a while since he's been able to catch a Stream Bros thing, since we seem to go when you're asleep. Ah. Well, we, um, we're doing Sundays now. So, uh, and in fact, today we're doing Sunday, like, all day. Um, we're shifting the schedule around a little bit. I'm doing my usual 1 to 4 right now. Uh, Matt's going to come over and join me at 5. Uh, we're going to continue with uh, Wolfenstein The New Order, but um, <laughs> alright, you can go behind the computer, Cat. Uh, we're going to continue with Wolfenstein The New Order, but uh, instead of going for our usual three hours, we're just going to go for two. And you just won't be satisfied until you sit in my lap. Uh, so we'll be going from five to seven. And then Matt's going to head back home and do his uh, Alien Isolation stream from 8 p.m. onwards. Probably till like 11, maybe 10, I don't know. He didn't really say exactly how long he's going to go for. Oh. All right, let's kick things off here. But he, did, he wasn't able to do his uh, solo stream last Monday, so um, uh, he wanted to... Uh, make it up by doing it uh, today. Also, I have to leave a little bit early because I have to go and uh, photograph a concert downtown. So Sunday is done. Yeah, Stream Bros Sundays. Stream Bros. Right, Cat? You're excited. Andrew Dirtles in Dragon Age versus Adam Dirtles in Dark Cloud 2. Oh, is, that, is, is Adam live messing around in Dark Cloud right now? Oh yeah, he totally is. Nice. Extra Credits is also doing like a 12-hour design club, I think. Nice. Yeah, Lily started streaming arts. Too many streams! There's just too damn much going on. So yeah, I left things off in the hinterlands here, just sort of collecting shit. Uh, actually, hang on a second here. I'm going to move myself back into the lower right. Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Uh, um, yeah, we're running around the hinterlands, just sort of doing various mission-y things, nothing super critical, but uh, I sort of wanted to play around a little bit. So we just cleared this mage hideout. I'm going to go check out this landmark, I think. We could close that rift, maybe pick up two shards, and then I will probably head back uh, to my 
base and sort of see what I can do next. <laughs> so I could contact the Templars, or I could contact the mages. Well, you go to the Fallow Mire, Forbidden Oasis is nothing exciting. Aha! I could do some stuff here. There's a bunch of stuff here that's actual relevant quests. It is what can't you do. This this is this game is extremely deep, I am discovering. I'm enjoying it. While I run around the woods. Just head over here to this column of light. It's very unassuming. Hey, what's up, buddy? Fire. Oh no, battery low. Why didn't I plan ahead? <laughs> okay, that was amazing. I mean, it meant that I didn't hit him at all, but it was really funny. Oh wow, there are a lot of guys here. I'm just gonna maybe drink a potion. We are the Inquisitors. We will not be defeated by a bunch of outlaws. Scoff laws, even. I will use my lasers on you. They're super magical and shit. Well, I think that was all of them. Sweet. Activate for indefinitely. Sweet. Oh yeah, I guess I don't have a taunt, I suppose. Maybe that might be worth bringing Cassandra back. I just I just really liked that moment where uh, I was using like this circle of flame explosion and Iron Bull just like tackled the guy out of it. He was just sort of like, I'll save you. Well, clearly I've been dirtling in this area too much. My inventory is full. Okay, this is supposed to be a landmark or something. Oh, it's probably over here. Here we go. Boom. I claim this weird stone thing in the name of whoever. <laughs> so there's a question mark near me. Always fun. Uh, I don't even know what those are supposed to be to a certain degree. But my inventory is full, so I think I'm going to go to camp here, ditch some stuff, and then investigate these. Let's do it. Also, I like that moving me from the upper to the lower resized me, and now I'm regular size on the camera. That's true, I could just... I don't know how many... I don't know how far away from a level Iron Bull is. It hasn't been a problem so far. That was the first time that I've really felt like Excuse me, my character was getting attacked a lot in combat, so... We'll see. Uh, there isn't anybody I can sell stuff to here, is there? Do I have any requisitions to turn in? Nope. Potions... Well, shit. 
Two Rogues is totally redundant. I just did, like, uh, this is banter party. This is comedy party. It is entirely uh, for the dialogue. This is not for combat at all. Uh, if I want to sell some shit, do I have to go back to the camp or... Oh, there's a merchant over here. Okay. Maybe I'll do that. I'm gonna go see that merchant. Ooh. Yeah, stuck forever. Come back here. Yeah, I can just walk over to the town. Alright, sweet. <laughs> Take that. That ram has terrorized the innocent citizens of the hinterlands for the last time. I don't even know where I am. Ooh, hello. Probably can't take anything. Yep, inventory's full. Well... enjoying coming back to this game like every Sunday. It's it's super super good. I'm I'm very into this game right now and I want to play it a lot when I'm not here, but I I do also do a certain degree really like the sort of It's almost like looking forward to a new episode of television kind of thing for me. Just like, ooh, I can uh I can go and play World I can go and play Dragon Age. All right. Let me see if there's anything anybody should be equipping. Uh, it's unique, but it doesn't seem to be better. So, 65 and 11. Yeah. Yes, let us let us give him uh, a bow and arrow. Yeah, he's got one that's ninety three, looks like. Yeah. I mean I could give him the claymore at ninety nine or ooh, hello. Yeah. Hundred and sixteen. That's not bad. What's going on, cat? Yeah, let's give him that. I want to give him a giant maul. I like that. And his armor is 58. Nope, that's incorrect. His armor is 88. He doesn't appear to have a helmet. So, let's give him this one. Uh, let's give him an amulet of constitution. And, I don't know, Delta Melee Defense sounds good. Enhanced Mighty Blow Ring, sold. Uh, yeah, Jaconius, I've heard that um, Dragon Age 2 is not the greatest. So, um... It's definitely, definitely something to keep in mind in that sense, I guess. Like of the of the three, I understand it to be the weakest by quite a bit. Varric actually has Caltrops, so I might as well give him that.
Why can't she use that yet? Oh, right, level eight. Soon, Sarah. Soon. Wow. That is an intense dagger. 139 TPS. And 126. Is double dagger actually just really good and I haven't been using it, chat? Like, help me out here. Holy shit. There we go. Might as well just equip a bunch of shit. Could probably use all of that for something. Might be able to use those. Mm -hmm. Definitely keeping Matt's butt coat. I should probably keep Bull's Edge. More DPS, but riskier being in the melee. Okay. There we go. Of course. Much better. Now then, where was I? Rifts. Gotta close me some rifts. Search the river for the package. Yeah, I think I'm going to hit these two, close this rift, build a camp, and then uh, do these two quests here. Because they seem to be sort of, they're, those two are appear to be story related, but minor. Like, unless I'm reading the quest log wrong, I guess. But, yes. I think I got it. That's where that character was. We just got a new agent there the other day, last time I was playing. Who? Be Ooh, <laughs> quest giver. Quest giver. More cold weather coming. Fool villagers. Where are their coats? What do you need to keep these refugees warm? Blankets, warm clothes, all of it. These poor sods lost everything when the mages and the Templars went crazy. If we were in a village, I could just pinch a blanket off a clothesline and be fine. Out here, I'm sure the apostates have plenty of supplies, just haven't been able to find them. Farewell. And to you. Good to know. Okay. Mm hmm. Ooh, hello. I love how gigantic these chests are. Like, you could fit a person inside there. You could probably fit a couple of people inside there. Collect shard.
Bring it. That's weird. It won't let me close it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> if you take Knight Enchanter as your specialization, it doesn't matter what your party is, you can just solo the game. Wow. Yeah, I've actually, I have heard that Knight Enchanter on hard, like on the hardest difficulty, if you can get Knight Enchanter, it's easier than basically anything else. I don't know what the X's are. Oh, just points of interest. All right, let's get our asses over here. Ooh. Apparently, there's a mountain range in the way. It appears to run on some sort of electricity. Oh, hey, landmark, landmark, a bunch of people. Just go south to my cool place. <laughs> Come for the video games and bros. Stay for the cats. Stay for the cats. My cat is just very much used to being the center of attention. She wouldn't have it any other way. Elfrude. I haven't really been hearing a lot of banter from my crew yet. Like, I don't know if that's indicative of something. What's up, Wolf? You're on fire now. You're frozen now. Hey, you go away. Bad dog. Short and sweet. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so what is new and exciting with you, chat? It has been a week. I expect that you've done some cool shit. I haven't. I mostly worked. Uh, I did go to a uh, Stars concert last night, though, which was pretty awesome. Uh, that was wicked fun because I went with a whole bunch of people. Is that a rift over there? That looks like a rift. It seems rift-esque, I think is what I'm trying to say. Whoa, level 12. Level 12. Run away. Run away from everything. Don't go that way. <laughs> Shit. Bravely ran away, away. Yeah, Sarah's just super fucked up there already. Jesus. Uh, can I get across there? I think I might have to run past these guys. Yeah, okay, fuck it. Do, do, do. Pay no attention to the tiny, fragile pink things. Let's do it then. Ah, oh, if you have characters that hate each other, they banter more. Um, and banter happens more during quests. I currently have Sarah, Varric, and Iron Bull. It's a pretty sweet party, I gotta admit. 
Ooh, Jaconi has finished editing the third episode of his Edge of the Empire podcast. Nice. I don't have Cole yet. I I was looking at the characters page on the website the other day. Um, and it looks like there's Cole and two other people I'm missing. Um, so I'm actually a lot further along in the... Of the Kunari. Oh, you've heard of us. Oh, sweet. I spent some time in Kirkwall. That must have been fun. You could say that. Um, we're actually a lot further along in the collect all the characters game than I thought we were. Um, I had thought that I was like maybe halfway, but there's only actually three left, so. Yeah, it's Cole, Dorian, and I think one other I'm missing. But I'm not sure if the third person is a player character or a spoiler or what, so I don't know. I'm being quiet. All right, sweet. Oh, wait. Is there any stuff in here I can steal? No. If you go to Red Cliff, you'll meet Dorian. Okay, sweet. Um, I guess that begs the question, then, do we want to go to Redcliffe? Is this Redcliffe? Yeah. I think we should head in that general direction. I think I want to kind of circle around over to here. Let's see what we can do. It just, the hinterlands are really pretty. I'm enjoying wandering around them, solving everybody's problems. It's fun. <laughs> I suppose this must be Master Dennett. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, that's not where I want to go. I mean, I can probably break in there, but I should probably go talk to the well, actual guy around, first. Right? So you're the Inquisition, eh? Here you're trying to bring order back. High time someone did. Never thought it'd be a Haller rider from the Wildlands, though. Name's Dennett. I served Arleman for 30 years. I remember Arleman. I hear your Inquisition is looking for mouse. <laughs> that's correct. It is. Can you help us? Not at the moment. I can't just send a hundred of the finest horses in Ferelden down the road like you send a letter. Every bandit between here and Haven would be on them like flies on crap. You'll have mounds once I know they won't let them at the cold winter's breakfast. If you have a problem with me personally, I'd like to know about it. What? This because I called you a Haller rider? Those Haller are damn majestic beasts. I'll give my right arm to ride one. My wife Elena manages the farms and Bron's in charge of my guards. They'll tell you what they need. Until then, you deserve something better than whatever knock-kneed plowneck they gave you. The chestnut over there is a purebred Ferelden Fordo. Take care of him. Sweet, free horse. Good to see you, Inquisition. You said your wife Elena is in charge of the farms. Yes. A lot of families work our land. They work for us and we take care of them. Elena knows the farms better than I do. Knows what they need. I imagine not being killed by anything would be a start, though. You said you were once Arl Eamon's stable master. Master of the mouse. Ferelden's don't appreciate horses like they do in Orlay. But they knew my name in Val Royale. My horses took sick less and carried a man longer than any of those fancy prancers they've got. You take care of my people, and I'll make sure your Inquisition is riding right. Sweet. What can you tell me about the wilderness around here? Got some old ruins in the forest, from long before any king of Ferelden. The lakes are pretty. 
Though when the weather's odd, you hear tell of spirits. Beyond that, my daughter Sienna set up a track just over there. Fool girl likes to race the horse. Oh man, horse racing. Horse racing. Could use your help. Right now, any food I give those luckless bastards might as well go to the rebel mages or bandits. Talk to my man Bron. He'll tell you what those folks need to protect themselves. Once that's done, I'll give as I can. I've no problem with charity, long as it's not wasted. All right, this guy's pretty baller. Watch yourself, Inquisition. It's ugly out there. You are, you are a boss, sir. You are a bro. I will probably not break into your house for at least five minutes. I heard what my man said. If you want our horses, then we need our farmers back safe in their fields. Since the breach appeared, the wolves have gone mad. They come after our men like beasts with the water sickness. You deal with the wolves, and our farmers will be safe again. <laughs> I can do that. How are these wolves like to I am I am a professional wolf killer, lady, let me tell you. Race me around the hinterlands. God damn it, laser beak. Worst. They're possessed or something like it. I've lost too many men to the beasts. I won't endanger more. Farewell. Okay, kill wolves. I wasn't super expecting this to be a quest hub, but sure, I'll take it, you know. Fancy trying out one of my courses? What kind of racing are you talking about? I set up a course uh, the kind where I win a lot of money instead of saving the world. Yeah, I will. I don't know how to ride at all, but let's. Um. All right. Which one's my horse? Is it this one? Are you my horse? Bam! Horse rider. Hell's free to gallop. Oh, sweet. Okay. I'm on my horse, dude. Where's the starting gate? Is it this one? No. I don't understand where I'm going or what's happening. I'm just running around like a crazy person. My objectives are unclear. I'm just going to give up. Okay. So it looks like that is the start, and then I have to run through these gates. Okay, and then that puts out the fires. I gotcha. All right, whatever, I should be able to start a new one back here. <sighs> Do I need to get off my horse to talk to you? This is bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> my horse is badass. I would like to try again, now that I know how shit works. Brace you around the hinterlands, motherfucker. Ah. Oh, this is a way longer course than I thought it was. Bam! Take that. Give me all your money, poor person. 
I just wanted I just wanted to win money at horse racing. Iron Bull approves of my horse racing. Yes. I'll speak with you later. Nope. I'm sorry, I was trying to get off my horse. I didn't mean to accidentally light your stables on fire. Uh, the keys are like right next to each other. <laughs> oh man, yeah, if they were more narrow, my staff would just catch and just get flung back off the horse. Well, okay, I've I've done that quest. I don't need to do that quest anymore. I need to speak with Braun. I like how it's just like, locked door! Is there any disadvantage if I go and break into that? Like, does this guy get mad at me and not give me horses? Or can I just, like, break into his shit with impunity? Out of my way, weird animals. I have an ocularum to look at. Go forth, mighty horse! Let's fuck shit up. Yeah, mighty horse. Whoop. Shard. 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 I don't think any okay, so it's like Legend of Zelda style. It's just like whatever. It's basically communism. I don't think I'm gonna attack the Druffalo. Hey, what's up? Druffalo. Beefalo. Beefalo. Alright, let's go break all those shot stuff. <laughs> Tries to get on horse, blows up stable. Uh, I'm assuming that's you then? Nope. I'm assuming that's you then? Nope. Well, so much for thievery. Our life of crime is over already. Oh, there are three different tracks. Okay. You don't take fall damage while riding? Oh, man. <laughs> I'm going to get on that horse and jump off some shit. Uh, hey, Amber Becky, welcome to the chat. Welcome, welcome, Sunday Afternoon Dragons. So, I, you want me to build you watchtowers, I guess? Alright. No, Cat, I'm building watchtowers. Well, I appreciate that, but these people are in danger. Yeah, just build a watchtower, no big deal. Honestly, probably I'm gonna ride there and it's gonna be like, build watchtower here and it'll be just like one button. Because, you know, I'm badass. One button watchtowers. Oh yeah, there's a shard. Nope, sorry cat. My lap is my own. Consent is important. Uh, I have heard that, um, I've, I've heard that, uh, the lockpicking perk is not super useful in this as well, uh, Zenaid, uh, Zenaidi, Zena, Zed guy, um, which is weird to me because I'm so used to like the Fallout series where it's like, shit son, you want, you want some lockpicks, let me tell you about the lockpicks. Okay, so these are all just shards. I can go get those later. Oh wait, farmland security is the watchtowers. Two, where's the third one? Three? Oh, three? Three? What the fuck? I don't know where the third one is. Well, whatever, I'm gonna go see this guy. Dope. Trapped forever. Let's 
good thing these people don't take good, take good care of their fences. Prize-winning Druffalo! Druffy! Ah, Druffy. Good old Druffy. Alright, let's go set up a tower. Because I'm facing this direction already. Do, do, do. I think this is where they want me to go. Yeah, like just up there, I guess. Can I get up this way? It's probably... Oh no! I lost my connection to the Dragon Age server. Hopefully you guys can still see and or hear me. But not taste and or smell me. But I may be gone forever. Thanks, Internet. All right. Let's see how big of a watchtower I can build by pressing one button. Oh, apparently I just mark locations. Apparently I just... I'm, I'm a surveyor, I guess, is what I'm saying. Are you going to tell them or shall I? Tell them what? Oh, okay. DevTools is worth getting, but after knowledge. Got it. Uh, landmarks. Doop -doop -doop. Are you my Druffy? Hello. Gonna keep jumping on these guys. Damn it, like like an animal in a cage. Despite all my rage. I'm gonna go close the shit out of this rift though, I tell you what. I tell you what. Hey, what's up, buddy? jumped. Ow. Let's see if I can pull off this long cast. Ah! Nope. 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 Not happening. I really like using the rifts to disrupt the guys, but it's it's such a long cast that it's it's really hard to do. Instructions unclear, nose caught in PS4. Right, Love it. So, you seem the type. Or exactly not the type. I forget how these things are supposed to work sometimes. You don't forget anything. And you notice that's why you're buttercup. What? All right. I still don't know where this third tower is. This is one here. Oh, it's oh, it's way out there. That's yeah. I guess you would be able to see stuff coming, but you wouldn't be able to warn the farm. You'd be like, "Well, guess I live here, 3,000 miles away now." All right. 
Let's continue on my loop. I'm going to come back to those farmland towers. I want to slowly make my way over to the land of the mages. Search the river for the package. I'm still searching for the river, actually, I'll be honest with you. It's the package. Yellow. Uh, that was a named coat, so it's probably decent. Uh, dwarf trained rogues. Uh, I wonder if I know any dwarf trained rogues. Bit of an upgrade. Bit of an upgrade. Let's take it. Oh, yeah. You're badass. I will absolutely deal with these wolves. Dead Ram Grove. All right. Uh, more like Dead End Grove. I guess I go downstream. This also looks like a dead end, though. Can I go over the waterfall? No. Some bullshit right there. Uh, now this is back to the farms. Uh, well, maybe there'll be a way for me to go left up here. But I'm kind of this is kind of open worldy, but then you run into these positions where it's like, okay, we're we are forcing you down this particular canyon now. You are going this way. Okay, that's up where the tower is, so let's follow along here. Ah, uh, I have to go back where that high-level rift is. Okay. Oh, not the end of the world. I can definitely survive it, it just hurts. Uh, this means I can actually, I can, I can rescue Druffy on my way by. Even better. Not a disadvantage at all. Unless these level 12 guys kill Druffy, in which case, you know, you're going to see some shit. see some nugs. Oh man, Druffy, Druffy has a large roaming area that he could be in, it looks like. Druffalo. Nugs. Oh, Druffy can die. It's an escort quest. Hooray. Alright. Fuck Druffy, I'm going north. The trouble with wolves is... Don't you hate airline wolves? Damn it. Okay, I think I have to go back to the river and then turn right. Uh, MD319 asks, what level are you? I am level 7, almost level 8. So that level 12 rift over there, I am giving it a wide berth. I'm just going to let that pass on by. So, I think I can go this way. If not, I'm just going to jump off the cliff for the sake of jumping off the cliff. Oh no, it's just a river. I can go this way. Pretty. Excuse me, are you wolves? I've been instructed to deal with you. These must be the 
Master Dennett's wife warned us about. <laughs> Very observant, Varric. Man, I'm pulling a lot of threat here. I should give Iron Bull taunt. Okay, Alana's reached level eight. That's me. Ice mine. Wall of ice. That seems useful. What do I got here? Oh, I can improve some of my... I use wildfire all the time. I think I'm going to upgrade that. Nobody else has any points to spend. Oh, barrier or fade step. Well, I should actually get barrier. I've been I've been doing without it for quite some time. How is fade step useful? It kind of just seems like a movement talent to me. Oh look, and there are also demons here. How convenient. Nope, you're gonna jump on me. Demon. Yep. Get away. Back this back that ass up. of the pack master sweet I'll take it oh okay if you freeze stuff you pass through that's pretty useful yeah like if it was just like a runaway talent I was like all right that could be useful but I'm kind of doing okay just brute forcing my way through every combat He said immediately before somebody murdered him. There we go. Alright, there should be safeguards against looters. Search the northern hills. Not sure what I'm looking for. Oh, sweet. That's one of the things I needed for the puzzle box. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Nope, nope, nope. Ah, oh, shit. 
can't walk, not adult. Fell right off a bridge. I am such a professional. I am the leader of the Inquisition. Oh no, I fell off a small bridge. You know... Just, just don't say anything, Chad. Just, just let it go. <laughs> I just can't walk today. Hey, it's busted. Busted. Welcome to Stream Bros. Where I'm stealing everybody's stuff. Still unclear as to what I'm looking for. For safeguards against looters. <laughs> Andrew and his traveling comedy troupe. Oh, that's up there. Loot. Something around here. What's on the agenda today? More Elfruit? Dude, so much Elfruit, you have no idea. We are just gonna fucking 420 blaze it. Okay, so there's somebody with a secret project in the cave up here. But like, where? Where's your secret cave? I mean, it's probably secret. But it never hurts to just ask, you know? Oh, Alfred. Oh, what you're looking for is up along that upper pathway you were on, sort of back against a rock wall. Okay. Where you just were, there's a crate. So back up here. Ah! There is definitely a crate. Perfect. I found... I haven't done anything with it, but I've discovered that this crate exists, and that's enough to earn experience. I've learned a valuable life lesson today. Uh, Alright, chat, let's... Unless there are no further objections, let's go to Redcliffe. Your voice doesn't count, cat. Huh. As a non-human person, you don't get a vote. So, let's slowly start making our way that way. Alright, oh, this is that dead end. I may have to go out the way I came in and around. It's kinda Sarah, I had a thought. The next time we run into a line of enemies, I'll pick you up and throw you. Get off. No, this could work. I loft you over the front ranks. You land behind them to flank. Mayhem ensues. I can't fly you, Dad. Yeah, I gotta go around. Alright. Think of the mayhem, Sarah. Mayhem. <laughs> I'd get a wedge up something fierce. Look, you and Varric are the only ones small enough, and he's pretty dense. Ouch. We'll do some <laughs> bloody presses. Yeah, just get stronger. Bull, do you even lift? Sweet. 
Wool Prince Jr. I haven't... I don't know if I'm really going to use a grenade belt. Alright, hang on a second. I'm going to... I'm going to hide in this bush here. And go get a drink. Please enjoy the calming, soothing, autumnal nature of this bush for one to two minutes. I sat down and ruined everything. Oh dear. All right. I'm glad I hid in there. It's safe. Uh, quarter note asks Andrew, do you know what the double bro game will be tonight? Yes, I do. Tonight's dual bro game will be uh, same as last week Wolfenstein the New Order. However, this time we won't have the Oscars to distract us, so maybe we'll actually pay a little bit more attention to the game. <laughs> No promises. <sighs> All right. Let's go. Bulls are for riding. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That was mayhem. I sat down. My computer fell over. We started spinning in circles. Like it's just, it was just nuts. Just nuts. I still think it looks like I'm just carrying a giant fishing spear. Oh, there's some guys to fight. What's up, guys? Did you want to fight? stuff. Porcelain cameo. Pretty sure that would have broken in combat. No. Loot, don't jump. We'll need someone to give a plot summary for, for Wolfenstein. I could not follow that story for the life of me. Don't worry, I will need a plot summary for Wolfenstein as well. But as near as I can tell, uh, what happened was... Uh, the Nazis won the war and we went into a coma for 10 years or so and then we woke out up, up out of the coma and now old people are helping us overthrow the Nazis um, as I understand it is this is this is what's up right, so I think I want to keep going this way because I can't cut directly across the mountain range, but if I go this way there will be a road to Redcliffe, because Redcliffe is kind of a big sort of happening town. Um, I understand they have all the cool new hip uh, mage plays, I guess. I don't think this is the road, but I think it might be a cave of... A cave of wonders! Or a cave of embryum. It may also just be a way through. Sweet. Yep, nope. All the latest in uh in 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 mage uh theater, mage concerts. Um a lot of famous mage authors live here. They have uh uh I'll, I'll like a wide selection of mage coffee shops. Um if you're if you're looking for some high quality mage coffee. Um real estate's expensive. 
It's kind of unfortunate. Have I run this joke into the ground yet? Are we? Have we reached bedrock? All right, cool. Oh wow! All right. That is not any of us. But look at that! Look at that light effect. That is sweet. That is very cinematic. All right. Did somebody say demons? I could have sworn somebody said demons. And as what I can assure you is a professional demon hunter, that's my cue. Come on, spawn him. Pulled it off. Nice. The old man was kind of a badass. No. So for those of you who just tuned in today on Stream Bros. Sunday, you're getting a sort of triple dose of... Uh There are many mages in Redcliffe. Make her have mercy. It's over. Open the gates. We're awesome. Uh you're getting a triple dose of triple A Stream Bros on Stream Bros Sundays. Because uh I'm playing Dragon Age, Matt and I are playing Wolfenstein the New Order, and then Matt will be playing Alien Isolation. Uh so if you're planning on getting anything done today, well, sorry. We're not sorry. Not at all. Hey, what up? I heard this is Redcliffe. We spread word the Inquisition was coming. But you should know that no one here was expecting us. No one? Not even Grand Enchanted the owner? If she was, she hasn't told anyone. We've arranged use of the tavern for the negotiations. Agents of the Inquisition, my apologies. Magister Alexis is in charge now, but hasn't yet arrived. He's expected shortly. You can speak with the former Grand Enchanter in the meantime. Former, you say? Is it just me, or is something weird going on here? Something weird is going on here. I like how in her little character portrait up there, uh, I can't see it now and I don't know how to get it to appear. Oh, there we go. Uh, Sarah is grinning like a mad woman. She is just like... Just, let's, let's get crazy. Alright, where's this tavern? Oh, wow, I'm still, like, way out of town. Yeah, just up ahead in the tavern, sure. Where's that? Uh, it's about six miles away. As the crow flies. Oh, I see. Do, do, do. Oh, wait. You should get Vivian. She has some conversations with Fiona that are super snotty and hilarious. All right. Uh... Oh, I have to backtrack a bit. Oh, fuck it. It'll be worth it. Okay, I'm tagging out... I don't know. Sarah for Vivienne. Let's say. Uh, where's my horn of party enchanting? Beric. Nope, that's not him at all. Vivienne. Iron Bull. Confirm. Uh, let me just quickly inventorize 
Vivienne. See what kind of see if she's got any sweet stuff. Disciple Ice Staff at 31. No, my friend, you have the wrath of Lovius. You're gonna fuck some shit up. You're wearing an Orlesian Henan with ten defense. I think not, my dear. I think you are wearing Matt's butt coat. Yeah, totally Matt's butt coat. And you can have a helmet too, I guess. Sure, we'll give you an enchant change lightning ring. What's this? Plus two bleed on hit. Yeah, sure. Go nuts. You know what? Yeah, you can have the grenades too. Just whatever, man. Oh, you can fast travel to Redcliffe, but you have to go further into town. Well, too late now. Let's get totally sidetracked and go do this ocularum. Oh, no, wait. I probably don't want to go that way. Right, no, because that's the way where that has the guys that'll murder me. That's the way I went before, where I ran into like a level 20 creature, and I was just like, mm, mm, nope. Yeah, so let's get the hell out of here, and let's go to the Gull and Lantern. Actually, no. Yeah, no, I can't fast travel to it yet. Mm -hmm. Wasn't thinking, chat. Sorry. <laughs> Excellent. My buddy Chris Whitman just noticed that I uh, snuck away his phone at brunch uh, and took selfies. <laughs> Perfect. That is, my, that is my absolute favorite thing to do, and I highly recommend you do it as well. Um, if, you, if you haven't seen me doing this at Desert Bus uh, or anywhere else... Uh, this is the 100%, this is the best thing to do to mess with your friends' uh, phones or stuff like that. Um, rather than, like, changing their Facebook status or their religion or making them like Nickelback, which making your friends like Nickelback on Facebook is pretty good. Um, what you do is you just take their phone, and even if it's locked, as mine is, you have to put in a passcode, uh... In the bottom right-hand corner, even on Androids, uh, you'll find that the camera is accessible. You just have to swipe up. Ta-da! And then you just point it at your face and take, like, I don't know, somewhere between 5 and 50 selfies of yourself making a dumb face. Like, just, uh... And then, ideally, you turn off their phone and put it back where they left it, without them ever knowing. Next time they go and look at their pictures, surprise, it's your face. It's the best. Oh, it's a lot of fun. It's ridiculous. Like, the the whole, like, it's really fun trying to do it as sneakily as possible so they don't know. Um, but also, like, it's harmless because it's just on their phone. Like... Nobody's ever going to get... People, people, some people don't react well to having their Twitter messed with. Um, so instead, you just you don't mess with their social media presence at all. You will address me as Enchanter Vivienne, court mage to the Empire of Orlais, or Madame de Fer, not Viv. Oh, right, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. Hmm, yes, ma'am works as well. <laughs> That was funny. <laughs> the world is... I really like the sort of the way they've set up the world map and everything because it feels really big. It's actually not that big in the sense of like we've already run back to where we're going. Is that a raccoon? Oh no, it's a fennec. We've already run back to where we were in like 60 seconds. But it's it's so dense that it feels larger than the actual physical square footage. And I really like that, because that's the perfect sort of mix of, hey, there's stuff everywhere, but it doesn't make you feel like it's going to take you, like, a year to walk there. Uh, also, I'm just noticing that I've never actually given Vivian any skills, and I should perhaps consider doing that. 
Because she's level seven and has nine points to spend. All right, chat, where are we taking Vivian? Spirit? Yeah, let's give her some spirit. Let's give her, let's give her barrier and elegant defense. Let's give her a bunch of threat reduction. And we got five more. We could give her dispel. Uh, mind blast. We could. Uh, I don't know. I was thinking of going full spirit for her, but we could kind of go down one of the other trees. Chat. Do you have a preference? Do you care? What do you What do you want to see Vivian fuck shit up with? If anything. Oh, the Ice Queen. That's not bad. Yeah, okay. I'm going to give her Wall of Ice. Yeah, let's do that. All right, so she's sort of icy spirit. There's a landmark up this hill. Seriously, watching watching me play this game must just be like that family, or is it Simpson sequence? Yeah, I think it's Simpsons, where he's just like, ooh, piece of candy. <gasps> piece of candy. <gasps> Collectible. Okay, landmark. I'm surprised it's still standing. The windmill. Hey, I remember the windmill. Holy shit, this is the windmill. How did... Can I get up there? Oh yeah, parkour, free stuff. I remember the windmill from Dragon Age Origins. Do 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 do. do. Mother, I had the dream again last night. Oh, tell me about your dream, bro. It was so real, and when I woke up, the sheets were as cold as ice. It's cold as ice. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, I'm not as bad with that uh, within the Dragon Age games, uh, but in if you ever watch me play an Elder Scrolls game like Morrowind or Skyrim or anything like that. I have never made it to the main plot in any of those games. I made it one mission in, and then I just get lost doing side quests and exploring dungeons and, like, just doing whatever in the world, and I never, ever make it to the second portion of the story. Just nothing. Ooh, there's something I should be looking for. Oh. A radar's going off. It's apparently in that building, though, so... That's no help. There's somebody up here with a quest. Uh, I don't think I... I think I'm supposed to go around, but I'm just gonna... Hello, let me into the back of your house. I heard there was a quest in here. Is it you? Too many people dying for of simple herbs. I can help you out with that. I have picked up so many simple herbs. Are you running short of healing herbs? Yes. With many injured from attack by those curses. Do you need elf fruit? I have like a million. It's too dangerous to go hunting through the hills to gather more. I've a list there of the herbs I need. There are refugees at the crossroads who would benefit from a healer. Of course they would. These attacks by the Templars have endangered countless innocent lives. But if I go to the crossroads to help, I might end up in danger myself. I doubt those refugees would risk their lives for a knife here. Why should I risk mine for them? Oh, interesting.
People are afraid right now. I haven't been called knife here as often as I'd expected. Mostly, all the humans say is thank you. I expect you'll find the same changes in mind. Agent Get? Agent Get? If the Inquisition soldiers are there, I might be safer regardless. I'll see you at the crossroads soon. Just give me a That's right. Come join the Inquisition. We'll keep you safe and we're not that racist. Probably. May I help you? Oh no, we already had that conversation. Nope. Give me no. I need to look at your list, bro. Did I just bug this quest out? Healing hand quest completed. May I help you? Oh yeah, I already had the herbs, of course. Yes. Goodbye. Quest complete. See, there's totally an advantage to me just trying to pick up everything. She's still showing up as a... Oh, wait. Can there... Again? Okay. A pleasure to see you again. Oh, she's not an agent. Okay, I found your herbs. I found some of the herbs you were looking for. Does this just happen a couple of times, or do, will she just, like, keep... Will she just suck me dry of herbs? Or is there just like two or three of these in a row? Because like I'm just looking at the list. Am I just trading herbs for... Oh, I'm finally low on something. All right. Moving on. This better not be another locked door. It is. Well... I claim this land in the name of Queen Isabella and King Size Bed. Do, do, do. Oh, look at that. I'm a wizard. I can fly. I can fly. Oh, maybe not. It's three levels, four. Okay. What if I took flowers to your wife's shrine, please? I... I do not know what to say, except thank you. You were Dalish. My sinner and I, we kept to the old ways as we could. Though I know we are as children to you. Her shrine lies on a hill to the west, near the table stones. Thank you. Stay safe. Everybody's just so chill, man. Okay, there's another quest giver back here. I saw something saying the hero of Ferelden. Is that the statue I looked at? Is that a statue of your Dragon Age 1 character? Because that's amazing. Is your Dragon Age 1 character the hero of Ferelden? I am not sure. No. I will climb this rock. I'll ask around again tomorrow. Well, let me know if you find one. Warden Alistair grew up at Red Bull. He used to play in the fields outside this very village. Uh, Alistair. That guy. Oh shit, he's the he's the king now? What? Tell me about your people. They say a spirit dwells in a small lake south of the highway. The girls of the village bring it daily. She's very quiet. Rarely does it listen. For it is a spirit of valor, not love, and it favors blood lotus flowers. What? 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 Something wrong, buddy? Huh? Huh? You got something to say to me? Yeah, that's right. You better, you better move on. Walk over into this corner. That's right. That's right. You came to the wrong neighborhood. <laughs> well, let me know if you find one. Oh. 
I guess I can probably sell some shit while I'm here. Is there something you need? I don't know, is there? Do you have really sweet stuff that I can't use yet, I guess? I think he's just going to use his... Yeah, you don't have anything better for me yet. That hat is ridiculous. Alright. One more quest giver over here. And then we shall go to the inn. Oh, probably going to have to actually go around now. I can't just keep climbing the rocks everywhere I want to go. One-Eyed Jimmy, what up? Please, are you with the Inquisition? As you wandered, have you by any chance seen a rat that is, um, different? Lord Wolseley wandered off, and he's very special. Oh my god. Okay, this guy's name is One-Eyed Jimmy, but he clearly has two eyes. What makes your rat so special? Well, he's always brought the family luck. And his advice helped us make our fortune. Your ram offered advice. He's a very special ram. All right. Your ram has gone missing. Yes. I'm certain that if he heard his Jimmy missed him, he'd come right back. He's likely at our family's old summer cabin. It's by the lake. <laughs> our old summer cabin. Oh, wow. I'd be happy to pay you. I'll speak with you later. You were the most ridiculous person when I did. Wow! <laughs> so, somebody just popped in over top of One Eye Jimmy here, and now there are two people occupying this space, just sort of phasing in and out of one another. That's that's pretty terrifying. I have absolutely had that nightmare. Oh dear. Let's do some story. Oh, it's a quiet Sunday today. It's nice. Oh. Welcome, agents of the Inquisition. Yo, what up? That's us. First in front of Vivienne? My dear Fiona, it's been so long since we last spoke. You look dreadful. Are you sleeping well? What has brought you <laughs> We're here because of your invitation back in Val Royale. You must be mistaken. I haven't been to Val Royale since before the Conclave. If it wasn't you who invited me here, who was it? I... I don't know. Now that you say it, I feel strange. Whoever, or whatever, brought you here, the situation has changed. The free mages have already pledged themselves to the service of the Tevinta Imperium. This right here is why you can't trust mages. Fiona, dear, your dementia is showing. <laughs> she's looking at Iron Bull when she says that, though. Worst thing you could have done, and I've got nothing. As one indented to a magistrate. 
I no longer have the authority to negotiate with you. Hmm. What about the giant hole in the veil that's spewing demons everywhere? You're just going to pretend it isn't there. I am not forgetting the breach. But we can only fight one war at a time. The Templar threat was immediate. If we live, we can worry about the torn veil. Welcome, my friends. I apologize for not greeting you earlier. Can you apologize for your ridiculous hat? Allow me to introduce Magister Girion Alexius. The Southern Mages are under my command. And you are the survivor? Yes. The one from the Fade? Interesting. I'd like to know more about this alliance between the Rebel Mages and the Imperium. Certainly. What specifically do you wish to know? I'm not clear on when exactly you negotiated this arrangement with Fiona. When the Conclave was destroyed, these poor souls faced the brutality of the Templars, who rushed to attack them. It could only be through divine providence that I arrived when I... It was certainly very timely. What does the Imperium gain from taking rebel mages under its wing? For the moment, the southern mages are a considerable expense. After they are properly trained, they will join our legion. You said not all my people would be military. There are children, those not suited. And one day I'm sure they will all be productive citizens of the Imperium when their debts are paid. The Grand Enchanter told me she was indentured to a Magister. Our southern brethren have no legal status in the Imperium. As they were not born citizens of Tevinter, they must work for a period of ten years before gaining full rights. As their protector, I shall oversee their work huh. in the Imperium. So... slavery then, huh? I haven't seen any sign of Redcliffe's Arl or his men. The Arl of Redcliffe left the village. Left? That's a polite way of saying thrown out on his ass. There were tensions growing. I did not want an incident. I'm here to get mages to close the breach. Right, to business. I understand, of course. Felix, would you send for a scribe, please? Pardon my manners. My son Felix, friends. I really don't like I'm these guys. I'm surprised you're here. Containing the breach is not a feat that many could even attempt. There is no telling how many mages would be needed for such an endeavor. Ambitious, indeed. Does that mean you'll lend your mages to our cause? There will have to be. Felix, I'm so sorry. Please forgive my clumsiness, my lady. Is there really Are awkward? Right? I'm fine, Father. Come, I'll get your partners. Please excuse me, friends. We will have to continue this another time. Fiona, I require your assistance back at the castle. I don't mean to trouble everyone. I shall send word to the Inquisition. We will conclude this business at a later date. Come to the Chantry. You are in danger. Seems legit. Ooh, very mysterious. We'll be careful, but we need to figure out what's going on here. We don't need your kind here. Your inquisition.
Inquisition is just Templars by another name. <laughs> I'm not even going to dignify this conversation by facing you. You'd rather bow to Tavinda than join the Inquisition. Don't tell me you bought the Chantry's lies about how evil Tavinda is. It's just because they're ruled by mages. No one wants us to look at them and say their mages are free and the world hasn't ended. But. Don't magisters summon demons and practice human sacrifice? The Chantry says whatever they think will scare us. What's wrong with blood magic? People what is wrong with blood magic? Controlling their thoughts, but they have no problem with us throwing fireballs in their walls. In Tavinta, the mages police themselves. It works. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, what is wrong with blood magic? If only the name was more... Descriptive. I'm here because I believe mages deserve their freedom. Right. And I'm the Empress of Orlais. Well, it's nice to meet you, motherfucker. Magister Alexius wishes only mages to remain in Redcliffe. He will approve of you. Does not approve of me. Many villagers have already left to escape. Rename fire. what, Stoffer? Strawberry magic. Strawberry magic. He does not like to be reminded of what mages can become. He says all tranquil must leave Redcliffe, but who would take us in? What a tranquil. Those like me, without the strength of will necessary to protect ourselves from demons. Rather than risk me becoming possessed, the Circle removed my connection to the Fade. My magic is gone, along with my dreams and desires. Those now in Redcliffe will prefer not to see us. How long have the Divinters been here? Magister Alexius arrived at nightfall. Two days after we retreated from the Temple of Sacred Ashes, he forced me Yeah, if Tevinter people can control thoughts, I'm pretty sure that's what's going on here. Even the arm was sent away. What? You told me I could recruit this guy. Aha! I'm a leader, motherfucker. You must require potions. If the Magister will not have me here, perhaps I can offer my services join the shit out of us bro thank you while one lives it is good to believe there is still a use for one's talents their totes is agent acquired free xp And you doubt it. <laughs> it's true. I will never doubt you again, my friend. Bard songs, best songs. Yeah. Did you download them from the website? I don't know if they're still up there. But we did have a thing a while ago where you could download all the tavern songs for free. How did the Grand Enchanter end up working with Tevinter? 
One minute, we were bracing for the Templars to attack. The next, we had a Magister ally. It was a stroke of luck that's given us an edge. In a way, out of the frying pan. My cat is just like nuzzling her head into my arm here. It's really cute, but it's off camera. I can't move. The Tavinsas likely aren't handling or asking questions. Fuck them. Uh, okay, so we should leave this building, I guess. You should totally bust out your violin. Yeah, the Randy Dowager Quarterly. Uh. Exhibitions for the noble of thought, but spry of step. Loading, please wait. If your loading screen lasts longer than four hours, please see a doctor. Back outside. Iron Bull walks in a circle. All right. Actually, I want to go see. I want to go see this business arrangements business first. Do do do, and then I'll go to the chantry. Chantry, chantry, pantry. To the pantry. Sister Tanner, what up? You may, motherfucker. Are you a chantry sister? I work here to help the poor and extend the Maker's kindness to those who need it. It is very busy, especially in these times, but let me know if I can ever help you. I found the letter you sent a Templar named Corin. What? Shit. You can't prove anything. A letter from a rogue Templar. Nobody is going to care. So, what do you intend to do? What kind of card are they giving? Have you got protection? I see a suspicious lack of guards. It looks to me like you've been cut loose. Maybe you should look for a new employer. Are you serious? The high and mighty Inquisition needs smugglers. All right, I'm in. Yeah. The Inquisition is a safer bet these days. Additional agents. Oh shit! They even get they even get the handshake. Where it's off camera. That's my favorite thing about every Bioware game. Everything that everybody does with their hands is just off camera. Because it just, with their engine, it just looks awkward as shit, I imagine. So, like, anytime anybody hands something, it's like just below the screen. You can never see their hands. It's a good thing I had Varric with me for that one. It's a good thing. Spoilers. Banned. No. I figured Dorian would show up here in Redcliffe somewhere. Good. You're finally here. Now help me close this, would you? <laughs> All right. You're awesome, Dorian. Just 
There we go. Fascinating. How does that work exactly? <laughs> Pins me, I just kind of You don't even know, do you? You just wiggle your fingers and boom. Rift closes. Who are you? Ah, getting ahead of myself again, I see. Dorian of House Parvis, most recently of Minratus. How do you do? Watch yourself. The pretty ones are always the worst. Suspicious friends you have here. Magister Alexius was once my mentor, so my assistance should be valuable, as I'm sure you can imagine. <laughs> Quit grandstanding. I was expecting Felix to be here. I'm sure he's on his way. He was to give you the note, then meet us here after ditching his father. Alexius couldn't jump to Felix's side fast enough when he pretended to be faint. Is something wrong with him? He's had some lingering illness for months. Felix is an only child, and Alexius is being a mother here, most likely. Seems legit. Are you a magister? <laughs> All right, let's say this once. I'm a mage from Tavinta, but not a member of the Magisterium. I know Southerners use the terms interchangeably, but that only makes you sound like my parents. You're betraying your mentor because... Alexius was my mentor. Meaning he's not any longer, not for some time. Look, you must know there's danger. That should be obvious even without the note. Let's start with Alexius claiming the allegiance of the mage rebels out from under you. As if by magic, yes? Which is exactly right. To reach Redcliffe, before the Inquisition, Alexius distorted time itself. He arranged it so he could arrive here just after the Divine died. You catch on quick. Manipulating time itself? Many have attempted over the ages, but never once succeeded. The rift you closed here. You saw how it twisted time around itself, sped some things up and slowed others down. Soon, there will be more like it, and they'll appear further and further away from Redcliffe. The magic Alexius is using is wildly unstable, and it's unraveling the world. You're asking me to take a lot on faith. I know what I'm talking about. I helped develop this magic. When I was still his apprentice, it was pure theory. Alexius could never get it to work. What I don't understand is why he's doing it. Ripping time to shreds just to gain a few hundred lackeys. He didn't do it for them. Took you long enough. Is he getting suspicious? No, but I shouldn't have played the illness card. I thought he'd be fussing over me all day. My father's joined a cult. To Vinter supremacists. They call themselves Venatori. And I can tell you one thing. Whatever he's done for them, he's done it to get to you. Alexius is your father. Why are you working against him? For the same reason Dorian works against him. I love my father, and I love my country. But this? Cults? Time magic? What he's doing now is madness. For his own sake, you have to stop him. It would yeah. also be nice if he didn't rip a hole in time. There's already a hole in the sky. Why would he rearrange time and endanger the Mage Rebellion just to get to me? They're obsessed with you, but I don't know why. Perhaps because you survived the Temple of Sacred Ashes. You can close the rifts. Maybe there's a connection. Will they see you as a threat? If the Venatori are behind those rifts or the breach in the sky, they're even worse than I thought. Do you have any suggestions? You know you're his target. Expecting the trap is the first step in turning it to your advantage. I can't stay in Redcliffe. Alexius doesn't know I'm here, and I want to keep it that way for now. But whenever you're ready to deal with him, I want to be there. I'll be in touch. Oh, and Felix, 
Try not to get yourself killed. There are worse things than dying, Dorian. Interesting. Haha, <laughs> free loot. Thanks, church. I'm taking all your stuff. Free XP to do 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 to do. So after this, the main story will make you choose a side. Uh, I'm assuming like the mages versus Templars thing. Loading. Please wait. Well, the malcontents pledged themselves to Devinta and joined a cult. I can hardly wait to see what comes next. Yeah, I saw something like this back in Kirkwall. It may end with someone turning into a monster made of corpses. <laughs> Um, can I opt out of that? I don't want Corpse Monster. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, these are the apostate caches, aren't they? Yeah, they're way out there. Yeah, I think I'm probably, I'm, I'm pretty clearly going to take mages, particularly as my character is a mage. Um, let's see where we can go next. Oh wait, I probably enough stuff has happened that there's new conversation options with everybody. Do you need something? Oh, well, maybe not. That's enough for now. Another time. Do do do. Who's over here? Oh yeah, Corin. Her crown. Can I help you with anything? I'd like to know more about the Iron Lord. But she 